welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you how to do these brows and i'm starting off with the bare face and i'm just going to take these two faux locks and pull them back so i can be out of my way and out of my face and my face is very bare i don't get my eyebrows waxed threaded anything this is literally how i was born and nah. so i'm going to turn them into that into something beautiful and i'm going to be changing it up and using the Benefit Brow Pomade in the number 6, which is the darkest one. And I'm using the Anastasia number 12 brush, which is the spoolie and the angle brush. So I'm just taking some of the Benefit product and I'm literally working it in at the top. Uh, I really don't have like a structured like way that I do it. I literally start filling them in, filling them in and like making a shape the top and like I just kind of follow like where my arch is and I have like non-existent tail of my brows so I literally have to make it so as you can see I'm literally like making the tail of my brow and arching it and then filling it in with like short strokes of the Anastasia brush And you just want to make sure you connect the lines and it's not going to be perfect. I mess up with my brows all the time so it's not going to be perfect at all. But you always can correct your mistakes when we're going to go in with the concealer. But then I'm going to like use the leftover product that I have on my brush and I'm going to feather it out at the front by making upward motions like move the brush upward and like almost make hairs and that will just make your brows look so much better in the beginning and like fade them out so yeah by doing that and then you can brush it out a little bit with the spoolie at the end and then i'm going to use the maybelline fit me concealer and i'm going to clean up my brows so um i'm basically going to use a sephora brush it's a double ended brush and the concealer part is my favorite 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 I love it so much because it's so skinny and like precise it just gets I don't know it's just really good so I use this and I literally trace over what I just did and then I like start to clean up like little spots that I don't want anymore so like if I make my brows too thick or if I make them like too much I go in and just conceal some more I also use my finger to like wipe away some of the product and also blend it in and I also use some of the back of the brush sometimes to also blend the product but most of the time your finger will do the trick so you don't really need it but after you go in the conceal you can also go back in with the brow pomade to like fix up also because sometimes you might wipe away something that you actually need so that's also what I do and yeah, this is just what works for me. Um, if you guys have any other ways of doing your brows, because I know it's like so many different ways of doing them. Then, I mean, you can leave comments down below and suggestions and all that. I'm open for them. But no negativity because that's not what we're here for. But, yeah. So, just cleaning them up and wiping away. And basically, once you blend it all out and your brows are just complete and you know just remember make sure your brows are sisters somewhat you know what I'm saying they could be stepsisters as long as they're related you know you know nobody's brows are usually twins just don't make them like foster children and different dads and stuff so yeah but um hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do enjoy this video please like comment and subscribe to me so you can see more like why would you not want to see more? And love you all. Bye.